Well guys, seems like I've got some more information to add to my Project Bluebeam notes. And this article published on AOL on March the 31st, 2014 goes on to say that NASA detects intelligent alien signal. And what's really the most interesting thing about this article is that it is complete disinformation because down the end you get to cut and paste some binary code into a translator and you will see Nanu Nanu April Fools. Now it is interesting that AOL has decided to go with the alien theme for their April Fools and it's also interesting to me that AOL thinks that April Fools Day is on March the 31st. So really the fools are you AOL because April Fools Day is actually on the 1st of April. So that's something that I find quite interesting. Now again we're seeing more of this alien news start to be reported and on RT we now have an alien craft or military spy plane. Notice how they say alien craft first though so that gets everyone's attention and of course it's over Texas and it just seems to be completely coincidental then that there are more Freemasons living in Texas than anywhere else in the world and that Alex Jones let it slip one night that that's because they are awaiting some prophetic event that's going to happen they think in Texas which is why it's the five pointed star because that's God's law onto foundation number five. As I keep showing with the information that I've managed to put together. So we've got to learn the symbolism if we want to learn their game. Okay? Because that's how they talk to each other. And that's how they talk to us but we don't know. And we're just like weak at their mercy because we don't know and we don't understand and we're completely unaware how they are fucking us over and they are all in on this together. RT, as I've said, is completely infiltrated with establishment so it's all just going to be basically propaganda and what they want you to see. But that's okay because you still get to actually see what they want you to look at and so you use it against them. But you don't get sucked into it. That's the worst thing you can possibly do. So this whole alien thing is just getting to an absolute ridiculous level at the moment. I just think that I've seen the last of it and then again it seems that I haven't. And I just wanted to also mention while I'm doing this video and catching up on my Project Bluebeam notes and on what the Jesuit are doing and the Vatican are doing, well, it seems that um, the bishops, Italy's bishops, pass Vatican-backed rule that child molestation does not have to be reported. I'll read that again. Italy's bishops pass Vatican-backed rule that child molestation does not have to be reported. Yes, they are creatures, okay? They are absolute creatures saying that if they suspect one of their disgusting part of this organisation is molesting children, they do not have to report it, okay? They are just sick. And they are just basically throwing it in everybody's faces. But it just seems to me that I cannot believe what it takes. The flock to wake up. I mean, I seriously think that they sit up there and they laugh and they say, 
can you believe what we can do to them? And they will take it and they will still go to work for us, still go and pay their bills and we can just completely fuck them over and they just accept it. I mean, this is what they do. And now they're just having the best fun at our expense because they know that they're basically, their annihilation is imminent. When the light fully returns, there's no way in hell that they can survive. Anything can. I mean, with what the information shows, that's just like the purifying, you know. And so if you can't match that light and handle that light and be a conduit for that light, then, yeah, I don't know about that. doesn't seem to work out too good for people that don't really follow the right path seem to think it's okay to follow the money god, which is who these people really are. And, you know, really, if you do look at these people and what they represent, they do represent the money god. They're lavish. I mean, I've got photos in my Antichrist folder of um, that Ratzinger sitting at a table just fully laden with golden cups and chalices and plates and... Oh, it's just absolute excess in the extreme. And that is because they are just really sick, twisted, evil fuckers that have nothing of any goodness to contribute to the collective. All they want to see is our demise. So we need to get smart. You know, we need to go and storm the Vatican when we see shit like this. You know, where is everybody? You know, hello? The Vatican just said it's okay to, um, you know, molest children and not report it. I mean, is anyone listening? These are supposed to be people that we have to aspire to morally. You know, we've just seen Obama and the Jesuit that represents this organisation basically ramming their tongues down each other's throats. But no, everyone wants to be blind. I mean, I just don't understand. This magic must be strong that they use on people because it's just absolutely acceptable for them to behave in this way, it seems. But anyway, so I did want to just report on those things that I have uh, found come to my attention. And yeah, this is a hoax, guys. And so just be mindful that we've got uh, the 1st of April now uh, over in the Northern Hemisphere. And so we're going to have all of this alien stuff probably or all these other stupid sigh of April, you know, fool stay jokes. So just be aware before you're sharing information around, have that in the back of your mind and just make sure that you check it. Well, I'll leave it here and I'll post everything underneath. And as always, peace out. <laughs>